So the term is Hasidei Umais Ha'ilam. It's three words. I'll spell it for you. So it's C H A S I D E I. Umais is U M O S, and Ha'ilam is H A O L A M. Ha'ilam. So it means Hasidei. You might have heard of Hasidim, right? Hasidim is also a safer Hasidim, and the Talmud refers to Hasidim as especially pious ones. Um, that's, that's Hasidim, but the word, the, the language, the uh, conjugation of the word is Hasidei, which means the Hasidim of. Umais means the nations. Ha'ilam means the world, right? That, that's what I believe is the, really the the proper term, meaning to say, there's a lot of people use the term Noahide, but the term Noahide doesn't differentiate between, the, the, the Torah doesn't talk about a Noahide, it talks about a Ben Naya. Every human being is automatically a Ben Naya. It's not an option because we're all descended from the same man, Noah. And every Ben Naya is obligated to keep the commandments. But those that keep the commandments, and they keep them particularly and specifically because they're commanded by God Almighty on Mount Sinai, who Moses is our teacher, they're called Hasidic Umas 